Rosso Ferrari. Ok, sì, sì, Rosso Ferrari va bene. Oppure Barbara, tu hai una macchina? Rossa Mercedes. Ok, rossa è eh, la macchina. Is a girl rossa, ok, sì. Bene, ok. Uh, hmm, what else? Can you say uh, la mia macchina è blu? Or... Sì, sì, yes. So if you want to repeat everything, yes. Allora, my suggestion in class, try to repeat everything. Don't just say sì, no. Mm? Try to repeat the full sentence. If you have no idea, of course you can do it, right? But we want to practice. Eh? Once you're in Italy, eh, you, can, you just need to say sì, no, rosso, blu. It's okay. Mm? E my suggestion is always copy the words in my question. Like Sheila said, la mia macchina. Because when I ask you, what color is your car? When you reply, the car is yours. So you say, my car is red. And you need to say la, not just mio macchina. Esatto, yes. And we'll see this again, yes. So possessive adjective in English, you would just say, my car, my house, my pen, my phone. In Italiano, we are saying, the, my car. Mm? Always the, the article, yes. Okay. Uh, What else we can ask to someone that we don't know? First time we meet somebody. Che sposata? Sei sposato o sei sposata? Sì. Per esempio, sei sposato, vagai. Sposata, femmine. Ok, this is a personal question, but ok. Sì, sei sposato o sposata? Sì. Who wants to answer? Ho sposato per 59 anni. Wow! Il dicembre. Sì? Sei so. Bravo! Maybe forse. E, of course, naturally, I'm going to ask you quanti figli hai? Quanti figli hai? Oh, oh, I was looking at da because I didn't say da. Uh, you said per, uh, yeah. yeah, we have to say da. da. Per, you would only use it, uh, uh, oh, yeah. just say da, since 59 years. Okay. Quanti figli hai? Ho quattro figli. Quattro figli, yes. Sono maschi o femmine? Due maschi, due. Uh, all doing masking, uh, doing feminine. Feminine. Sì. Papers. 
if you have many papers in your notebook. Fogli. How about foglia? Foglia. You have an albero, you have a branch, and then you have this. Foglia. So, foglia is singular, leaf, leaf. This is leaves. Foglia. Yes, exactly. So, yeah, you, you have to think about even uh, similar sounds and cognates with English. Foglia, for example, would be a good one. Yes. Okay. So, it's just a matter of reading everything, no shortcuts. See? Can you go over one more? Certo, sì, sì. Thank you. Allora, figlio, figli, figlia, figlie, foglio, fogli, foglia, foglie, foglie, yes, foglio, fogli, foglia, foglia. Open your mouth, that's the secret. All the time, see? Again, if you say no, eh? foglio, fogli, foglie, ye, yeah? This is almost like your. Well, I don't want to do this because it's complicated, and maybe if you check the chart that I gave you, it's easier. But uh, also, sometimes you have to find common words. Hmm? Foglia, foglia. So, vowels matter, let's say Sharon has, she said she has four kids. Figli, okay, she has quattro figli. So, I don't know if she has three uh, daughters and one son, if she has two and two. The guy wins all the time. So, if she has one son and three daughters, it's like they are all figli. See? So, Sharon, I, you said, uh, figli o figlie? Mm -hmm. Oh, do we figli, figli, e do we figlie, figlie, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> due figli e due figlie, yeah. yes, I know it's weird, right? Però, open your mouth, yes? Per esempio, Sheila, quanti figli hai? So that would be the question. Quanti figli hai? Ho oh, due figli. Figli? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, un maschio, can I say maschio? You can, <laughs> to avoid the problem, yes. Okay, I can say una figlia sì. e uno figlio. Sì, perfetto. Of course, you could just say maschio e femmina, eh? Yes, però we want to practice again, we want to say these vowels. Sì, perfetto. Tu, Michele, hai figli? Hai figli? Do you have kids? Hai figli? Zero. Zero, bravo. Ah, zero va bene. Oppure io sei non ho figli. Eh? I don't have figli. Perfetto. Sì? Oh, hi. Oh. Ah, the H is silent. So you say non ho, ho figli. Sì. The H, you have to write it when you see it, yes, because otherwise it's, it's other words. I mean, yes, but it's always silent. Non ho Okay, then ah, let's go back to the book. Uh, so we read the first line, these people were introducing themselves. In the second line of picture, this guy on the right is talking <coughs> to them. It's like, you guys, boy, venite dal Ghana? Mm? So it's like, do you guys come from Ghana? 